Class B South Boys taking the spotlight as the Expo, the place to be for the regional final four. As we go, check out the boys semis, Yarmouth and York. York turning offense or defense to offense. JP Frazier, the steal and finish. 15-12, York after one, looking for some redemption after Yarmouth took the opener to the season over York. But Matt Waldner goes to work. He had 8-16, his team up 12 in the third. Clippers running, Peter Sihojas threads the needle to Evan Ham. they're up 11. Then York tries to challenge Sihojas, not happening. Rejection to end the third quarter, Clippers up double digits. Playoff Pete then puts it out of reach. He had 19, work in the post, 50 to 41 Yarmouth. They're moving to the regional final. I mean, York's an amazing team and I think it was just our defensive intensity that we knew we had to pick up. The other regional semifinal had Miranda Cook, the nine seed, and four seed Madomic Valley. Miranda Cook looking to keep that Cinderella run going. Madomic, though, lowering the hammer early on. Trevor Brown spins and finds Jaden Starr, 22 to 8. Madomic after a quarter. Didn't get much better for Miranda Cook in the second. Brown working in the soft part of the zone and one. He had 14. And what can Brown do for you? How about set up Blake Morrison for the sweet layup? 77 49. Madomic and Yarmouth in the regional final. Girls B semis, number five York and number one Wells rivalry game. Wells trailed by eight early on. Now with an eight point lead in the third, Grace Ramsdale the put back. But Ramsdale went to the bench with four fouls in the fourth and York goes on a run. Ava Giacoba, the basket. Then the steal, Emily Rainforth, a four point run and they're up 44-41, the York bench and head coach Jessica Stacy. they are fired up. Then Rainforth who had 27 taking over. York did it with the press. They did it with their transition. They forced 22 turnovers. Rainforth the steal and lay in 60 to 52. The Wildcats beat the rivals to go to the regional final. That was insane. We, we came out knowing that that was going to be a super high intensity game. Definitely not like that. that. The game went back and forth so many times. Like we just run after run. Like their team would make 10 in a row. We'd make 10. Like that was just crazy. All right, the other semifinal had number two, Oceanside, number three, Spruce Mountain. Oceanside's Audrey Mackey feeling it from downtown. She had 19. Then the Mariners out and running. Emily Sykes to Olivia Morris, part of an 8-0 run. Mariners pulling away. Spruce hanging in there thanks to Olivia Mastine. She hits the three. She had 20, but no answer for freshman sensation Bailey Breen. She had 18 points, 12 rebounds, 56-41 Oceanside. And they move on to face York in the regional final. Southern Sea Girls top seeded in unbeaten Halldale facing Trape Academy. Trape came out thinking upset. Emma Hale from downtown. Rangers up four in the second. She had 15. But the Bulldogs in the half on a run. Hayden Medore to Iris Ireland for the basket and the foul. Then KK Wills for three. Bulldogs in the half on a 13-1 run. They're up eight at the break. They extend the lead in the third. Wills beautiful feed to a cutting Medore who had 14. Then Amanda Trepanier to Audrey Gilbert. 50 to 36. Halldale stays perfect. Winthrop and Old Orchard in the 4-5 matchup. Janelle Ferguson hitting the runner for Old Orchard. They're not just the Elise McNair show. Plenty of players stepping up tonight. Seagulls up eight in the third. Winthrop, a quick rally. Lydia Rice, the basket and one. She had nine. Then Morgan Fickborn beats the buzzer. Ramblers down two. In the fourth, Tessa Ferguson, the lay-in and the foul. She had 12 for Old Orchard. Seagulls roll from there. Sarah Davis, the three, and they pick up the win tonight. 43-35, they face Halldale next. Third seed, Karabek taking on rival and 10 seed, Madison. Bulldogs sticking around in the first half. Regan Cowan with the steal and the lay-in. The Cobras, though, put things together in the second quarter. Brooke Welch inside, she had nine. Then Courtney rolls from the perimeter, drains the three. Karabek by eight at the break. They pull away in the third. Cheyenne Cahill on the inbounds play, she had 14. Molly Hay added eight, 52-31, Karabek advancing. Third seeded NYA and sixth seed Kent's Hill. Panthers build the lead in this one. Angel Huntsman finds Charlotte Harper Cunningham for the three. Then Huntsman dishing later finds Sarah English. She had 14. NYA up 12 at the break. Kent's Hill responds. Regina Sabarova hits the three and they're down six. But NYA pulls away. Gracabilla had 16. 52-33. NYA moving on to face Karabek.